Hi guys, my name is Joshi Vibe. Welcome to my tutorial. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to implement an e-commerce web application using Django. As you can see, this is the finished product. We are going to be building this from scratch. We have the search functionality. We also have the product details. We also have the start shopping. And we also have the categories and then um, search functionality as you can see from here we are searching for milo okay it was able to bring up the milo product we currently have one category provisions and these are the two products we have next you can create account login here we are now currently logged in we have the checkout there's no product okay let's log in joshi password submit okay we are logged in now we have our account details the name joe biden joshi email now these are the orders we have i'm also going to be implementing the order histories that is what you are seeing here these are currently the orders we have made and yeah next i'm going to be showing you the payment gateway so you can see it yourself let's check out this product okay check out joe biden address new york Oh, let's use California, sorry. Um, zip code, any number, city, let's use Relims. Um, put in phone number, now. Okay, any number you want, just dummy. All right, let's check out. Da -da -da. We are currently in Stripe, we are able to see. This is the name of the product, Peak Powder Milk 400G, $50. All forms is the name of the company. All right, any at gmail.com. You can put in any name. Let's use the card number 4242. Okay, date. Uh huh. Okay, let me put in the name Joe. It's fine. Nigeria, that's where I am currently. Pay. All right, thank you for making purchase. You see, now let's go back to account. These are the products we have. The current order we made this is the history yeah um the front end might not look so good but the most important thing is the functionality so i'm going to be showing you that so you don't have anything to buckle up dance issues we're ready to start coding see you in the next video